my lovelies it's Odette here welcome back to today's video hope you guys are doing super awesome super well thank you for watching this video today thank you for clicking and thank you for tuning in I do appreciate it I have another makeup look for you guys today and I do hope you enjoy I've missed last Wednesday and last Friday's video uh, because my skin was breaking out a little bit because I've been doing lots of makeup videos so I took a bit of a break and I do hope you guys enjoy this one and two products I want to highlight because I did not highlight in the last one. Um, this is one of my favorite eyeliners. This is the liquid eyeliner from Rituals. It's really, really lovely. Love this very, very, very much. And the other one is the um, Select Cover NC50 from MAC. This really helps to cover up those under eyes where you can use this as a concealer before you put on your eyeshadows as well. Two of my favorite products I like to use when I'm doing my makeup. So. If you want to see how I came up with this very simple look, keep watching and I hope you guys enjoy and I shall see you next time. Bye! So the eyelashes are on and again these are called Chance, same set of lashes I have been wearing for the videos that I've been doing this month and I always like to tuck a little bit, just push a little on the inside just to make sure that they are nicely secured and someone sent me a DM and they were asking what colors do you have on your waterline because it looks really really pretty. And it's two things. This is a blue eyeliner pencil. This is from Marcel. And this is the NYX Jumbo Eye Pencil. And this is called uh, Pure Gold. Okay. So what I like to do is I take the blue eyeliner first. And just right in the corner here, I'm going to apply. Just like so. So I do have the blue on the inner corner and again any blue eyeliner will do and this is called pure gold again this is from NYX and this is a jumbo eye pencil it is gold and I'm just going to put this just on the outer corner of my eyes so when you take your pictures it really makes your eyes open up a little bit so that's what I do two things blue eyeliner pure gold jumbo eye pencil from NYX I'm going to leave them down below for you guys 
And so I am going to be using this foundation for the first time today. You guys would have seen this in my new buys for the month of August. I think it was last week's video. And this foundation is from, um, I was about to say next, it's from Morphe. It's the Soft Focus Foundation. I got two shades, Tan 23, which I used in last week's video, and this is Tan 21. Okay, so we are going to be going in with this today for the first time today, and it has a pump. So I'm going in with a foundation brush here. So I'm putting a little bit on here. And of course you guys know that I don't go in with too much foundation on my face because I just loathe it. So we're just gonna put this on and we're just going to blend this out. The foundation is very nice, matches my skin very well, and very, very soft. I understand now why this is called the Soft Focus Foundation, and of course this is quite buildable. This is medium to full coverage, and it gives you a semi-matte finish, really, really nice. And of course, I did not go in with too much, and I blended, blended this down all the way to my neck. Really nice. I can still see my skin imperfection under this foundation, which I really love to see. Really, really lovely. So I do like that. So now we're gonna go in with some concealer. This is from Milani. This is the Retouch Base Lightning Concealer. I'm going in with very little of this, just maybe just a couple of touches under my eyes not much at all i would just say three tiny drops because i don't want too much fuss with the face and i'm just going to blend this out easy look at how quick that was very 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 light under my eyes just to give my eyes just a little bit of highlight, not too much at all. So this is my MAC brush. I'm going to leave the number in the description box for you guys because I do like to use this brush just to set my under eyes. So this is my Laura Mercier powder. And I am just going to knock that off a little. And I'm just going to set right away. Just like that. Because your girl don't like baking at all. So that looks really good. Nicely highlighted there. So I'm just going to brush away any excess so i'm going to be using two powders today nw44 nw45 from mac i'm going to go in with nw44 first and this is my Oscar charles c102 brush love these brushes and i got these brushes from amazon they are so good And so this is my NW45 powder. And again, I love this powder so much. I'm trying to pan this. So I'm just gonna put a little bit of this just around my face. We are going to work on the lips right now. I'm going to be using this lipstick today for the first time. This is from Maybelline. You would have seen this on Instagram. This is number 211, Rosy Whisk. Love that, beautiful. And this is my Chestnut Lip 
liner. I feel like every time I do my makeup, something pink always ends up on my face. I don't know why. Anywho, this is Chestnut Lip Liner. Great combination. Rosy Risk number 211 Chestnut Lip Liner. Lovely. So we are going to set the face right now. This is from Revolution. This is the Revolution Pro Hydromat Fixing Spray with Hyaluronic Acid and Vitamin E. So this is almost like spraying water on your face, so I'm just going to do it from a distance. Ah, yeah. Smells good, but I don't want my face to be too watered down. Okay, that looks pretty much dry, so this is my revolution. Reloaded um, highlighter. This is called Make an Impact. And we are going to put a little bit of this on the cheeks. Oh, and by the way, guys, this is the Oscar Charles 103 brush. And the one that I use to put my powder on is the 102. I'm going to link the video for you guys somewhere just in case you want to pick up on a set of these. They are so good. And I've washed these brushes so many times. Oh my God, look at that highlight. I love that so much. Just up to the temple. And that's all your girl needs. This is called Make an Impact. And there we be, that is really nice. Let me pull the hair down. Just give me a second guys, let me get this together. Okay, my lovelies, here we are with the finished look of the makeup. Love the way this is turned up. Really easy, really simple. This is a foundation that I used today for the very first time from Morphe. The Soft Focus Foundation, medium to full coverage. This is 1021, and this fits my skin just perfect. This is the lowest I'm gonna go. So this is 1021. Last week's video, I used 1023, and I also have F3120 as well for Morphe. So those are my shades. So if you do have my skin tones, don't worry. These, um, uh, this shade is definitely for you. And of course, I went in with two different shade of powders, uh, NW44, NW45, just to balance everything out. But I do love the way this is looking. Love the lipstick, 211 Rosy Risk from Maybelline with the Chestnut Lip Liner. Good combo, just in case you wanna try these two. I'm going to leave those in the description box for you guys. So I would love to hear your thoughts on this makeup look today. Again, sound off down below. Let me know what you think of this makeup look. Again, I always say I am not very good at applying makeup, but all the videos that I've done, I'm trying really hard to teach myself how to do my makeup. And of course, I'm wearing the same style of lashes, Chance, that I have been using for the whole month of August for these beauty videos. And her shopping details are in the description box for you guys. If you want to buy her, you're gonna be getting a set of two not one two of them all the details will be below for you guys and i do hope you enjoyed today's video my name is Odette. thank you for watching and i shall see you next time bye